Yeah, we are, partner. I will say, um, when you get out the door tomorrow morning, patience, patience. It's still right. going to be rather humid, but the finish will be well worth it. Uh, yeah, and that uh, muggy meter is off the charts now. That's what was fueling some of those downpours that we had today in some locations. Scott Swan tells me his house got hit pretty well. I want to show you the radar rain estimates over the last 24 hours, the haves and have-nots. You get west of I-65, not a lot going on. We had some uh, heavy rain that fell from Franklin near Greenwood. And then look at these rain estimates over parts of Hamilton County. That's over two inches of rain. And uh, the heavy stuff went all the way up into Howard County as well. So some much needed rain. But now we've got, for the most part, a pretty quiet live Doppler 13 radar. Don't be surprised very late tonight, very early tomorrow morning, if you hear a few pops of thunder with this front that's going to be moving in. 86 today, look at that low of 74 degrees. Right now here in the city, we still have a very uncomfortable dew point sitting in the 70s, and uh, that's going to be part of the story early tomorrow morning. Here's the planner for Saturday. Before 10, 11 o'clock, a shower rumble of thunder is very much fair game. Then we finish with the sunshine. We finish with a dropping muggy meter as the wind of change takes charge here after the passage of the front. So there you go. That's early in the morning. You see some rain, albeit a little bit, not a whole lot, but it's there. Here comes the northwest wind. There comes the decreasing clouds, and it's going to feel very nice as we finish it off and even better tomorrow night. A lot of spots will be in the 50s Sunday morning. Sunday looks like a good day. There will be a little weak disturbance downstate, a shower chance. But most of us on Sunday should be in pretty good shape here. One of the better days of the seven-day forecast here that will show us going from near 80 on Sunday into the mid-80s middle of next week and could be wet the middle of next week as well.